Well, the good news is, master promos. All right. You literally use 99.9% .9 of Hecarim. How do you do that? What do you mean? Like knowing all my limits and stuff? That Yavi is because I have over 15,000 games on the champion. And when you play enough of a champion, you start to like know all its limits and stuff. You don't have 15,000 games on Hecarim. There is no way. This was the old ONL account. Season 4. Zero Hecarim games. Season 5. 50. Season 6. Adding 50, 400 total. Season 7. 800 plus another 300. 1100. Season 8. 1100 plus another 400. 1500. Season 9. <laughs> 1500 plus 1500. About... 3,000. Season 10. 3,000 plus another 1,500, 4,500. Watch this. Season 11. Wait, which was the one that had 3,000 games? Oh, yeah. Okay, it's because I skipped season 10. <laughs> I'm a psycho! Look at this! No way you have 15,000 games. Yes, I fucking do. I played 3,000 games in one season, season 10. And that was the first season I started streaming. Season 11 and season 12, right? I played even more. But the reason why it doesn't show is because I played on 20 different accounts. Literally 3,000 games a season minimum. Season 11, 12, 13. 9,000 games of Hacker at least in the last three years. <laughs> That's more games than I've played in my life? You don't understand. Like, when I tell you guys I'm addicted to this game, it's not, like, an exaggeration. What you guys have to get is that legitimately, from the time I was about 13 years old, 13, 14, I would get home from school at 2.30, and I would play until 11 p.m. every single night. And when I was in college, right, I would play for about an hour before I had to go to bed. And then Friday, Saturday, Sunday, I had off because of my schedule. So I would just play literally 13 hours a day on those two days. You guys have to understand that when I tell you I have the most Hecarim games on the fucking planet, I, I've literally had this game as my full-time career from the time that I've made $0 playing it. Genuinely. Int LL Stylish. He has four wins away from Challenger. How fucked up are you? You know what I mean? It's like it's like you say, Hey man, this guy is four steps away from getting to the top of the mountain. Push him down the hill. How fucked up are you? Maybe I actually should have done a level uh, one invade on the enemy's bot side since we have Zyra Khan and they have Zyra Yumi. But it's okay. We have a ward here, so there should never be a level three gank that goes off all in. He's either full clearing or he's being extremely fucking patient. Nice. Bucket's first blood. Keep Q-Stacks on Crab, and then if Shaco goes, like, top crab into mid gank, I counter. Okay, that's not the worst. Top one is going to be shoving towards Gragas, so maybe I could even look for, like, a gang top. Not the worst. You know what? Forcing the kill flash, what if I just went for Gromp towards Raptors and then we go for uh, top gank after my full clear? Okay, Shaco's 36, yeah. So I'm going to assume that he did his bot side clear and now he's going to reset and go for his top side. Unless what I could do here is we just go like Red Krugs. Ah, oh, nice. Now I'm just dead. Wait, what? She has six and she doesn't kill me there. When I have no W. Okay, this is how doesn't know what she's doing. Okay, I need to go for Bokang. Shaco's gonna be there soon, so I need to be there to counter. He's just been playing for bottle game. There's so many stops now.
huge. Dragon Soul here is a million times more important. Oh, <laughs> the electrocute, nice. Alright, I'll just recall and look for look for the uh, herald. The only problem is though that if he's on it right now, it's gone. I don't know what this Greg has just said. Mm, I would chase this, but the thing is that's ping that Akali's missing. I'm not going to walk into this bush, because if I walk into this bush and Akali's waiting here, I'm dead. So my better play is to walk all the way around, and this way I can get a cute stack here. Then if Akali jumps on me, she's dead. I don't like that Zeri's getting fed though, because Zeri has fucking cancer, Yumi, and kill for her. But I mean, listen, we have Hecarim and we have Assass or Zed, so double Assassin should be good. Okay, my team should rotate here. Okay, not bad. Perfect. There we go. Whew! Not bad. Just get reset off, go for Jackta, and then we can probably plat path straight for the dragon. Are you serious? They literally had fucking everything. How insane is that? Perfect. I mean, there's no way that they don't die, right? Okay, that's worth. Perfect. Serpent's next item. I mean, all I need to do at this point is just maybe kill kill inside, and then we look for Harold. Oh. I mean, I was gonna say I'd rather just Pyro Dragon, but if I just do Dragon first, then there's no way I can get the Herald because it'll despawn. Bro, I need this fucking Serpents right now. Fuck that cringe. Dude, why is Yumi so disgusting now? For no reason! They revive her! Yeah, and the only reason her it looks bad is because of fucking morons building Shirelias. Build a champion like a human being 52, 53. F Not smart because I want to save Smite for... No, what are you guys doing? Just take Baron. What? Good. Sucks I don't have red. Because having a little bit of health regen there would have been really good. Oh wow. <sighs> I mean listen, as long as they don't take the Baron, which they're not going to, we're off. We should just do it on spawn, honestly. Shaco's gonna Shaco's gonna steal. Never mind. I have a good smite. We're good. Whew! If I had a bad smite there, it was potentially game losing.
Forcing the Zari Flash and then also trading a 2 for 1 when I'm worth 600 gold. So it's like we trade even gold and we force the Zari Sum before uh, Soul Fight. Uh, so this next item could actually be huge here. Triforce Titanic Hydra, the champion literally for no reason has an extra 800 health. Throw Yumi on top of her. Even more through shields. So cringe. Alright, that's a call you out. Free fight now. Wow. What the fuck is that damage? <laughs> That's so insane. Perfect. Well played. Alright, now the game's on. Good. <laughs> Such an unreal champ. Oh my god, it's just so unreal. I mean, listen, I'm gonna have my shoulder soon once I get this. That's when the spike happens. Just get a triple and then we play Baron. The enemy comp was just so weird this game because it's like. It's not a hard comp for Akram to play into. But team fighting versus it is weird as fuck. Cause Zeri Yumi and Kale is just like so weird to play versus. Okay guys, I'm gonna be honest with you, I see a nine minute estimated Q and something tells me that my MMR might be a little too high right now. <laughs> oh let me go to the bathroom. I'm saying.